Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back. Today is episode, what is it, 9? Yeah, episode 9 of Let's Play Minecraft 1.51, and we are on New Eden server. And, uh, I got some lava cells. Woohoo! 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 So, Greg is, you know, if you guys never met Greg, he is a guy who is nothing but a troll. He was beaten as a child, and he takes it on all of us, I swear. Um, oh, this hopper's cheaper, and I think it has more slots. Five and a chest. But, you know what, Greg? I'm smarter than you. Actually, I, I highly doubt that. The guy is pretty brilliant, but don't tell him that. Um, okay, let's go ahead, and we're going to build a hopper for fun, since... Uh, they're vanilla Minecraft. Buildcraft actually came out with this idea before. I'm just going to put that out there. They deserve more credit. Uh, but whatever. Um, was it like this? I forget now. Yes. This is a vanilla hopper. And it's sexier looking than the Buildcraft one. And, oh, it has this bug. So, I don't know. Is there a way to change vanilla hopper... Orientation. There we go. So, we place that down. There we go. It's a little derpy when it comes to... Oh, look at this. doesn't have a... Likes to stick to walls. There we go. Anyways, um, yeah, this one has a little animation, not an animation, but a special block-sided thing. So you sometimes have to, like, do what I did. Maybe it's the way you face as well. I was facing this way. If Maybe I jumped down and did it directly. Let's try it, actually. Let's see what happens if I go like this. Oops. There we go. So, you know, I guess there's certain ways to it. So if this works, this should fill in there. So there you go. So, there you go, Greg. And it has five slots. I think the other hopper had like three or four. Oh no, maybe it had five or six. Either way, it's not bad. It's a pretty decent price to it. Um, okay. So there we go. We got the geothermal running. And uh, it's a nice power source. Uh, 20 E is a tick, I believe, which is great. These actually tell you something about them. Okay, so... Uh, in a GL30, 20 EUs a tick, and 20,000 EUs of power, which is pretty nice. It's a decent starting rate. And, uh, let's see here. 5K in a generator. Huh, I didn't know you could do it in a generator. 10 EU a tick. Huh. Never knew you could actually burn them like that. That's kind of cool. So, uh, let's go ahead and start doing what we were going to do. I wanted to look into storage, to be honest. That's the biggest key here. Um, and there's a mod called uh, Applied Energistics. Oh, Applied Energistics. Gistics. I, I suck with names. You guys are used to that by now. Um, so the first thing I'm going to make, or try to make, is the chest. It gets uh, pretty complex here, but here's the chest, and you need to make a conversion matrix. Well, the conversion matrix is... Ooh, a little expensive. You need nether and quart dust. Woo! So, I wonder if I can grind quartz down. Oh, let's right-click it. Can I grind down quartz in any way? You can. Okay, that's good to know. Okay. So, let's go ahead and try to make this chest. So, to make this chest, you're going to first need this stuff here. And you're going to need this thing here. So, and you're going to need silicone, which is, oh good, it comes from the nether one as well. Um, so let's go ahead and get this quartz knife here. Okay, we can use the nether one, which is good, and some iron. So, uh, here we go. We get you, we get you. Uh, oops, which one's iron dust? Put you back in there. Uh, oh, good, we have quite a bit of those. I was worried about that. Did I get the iron yet? No. Nope. And then we get some of these sticks. I have sticks before. Oh, we're going to make new ones. Okay, um, let's go ahead and go through here so we can see the mod a little better. 
Uh, apply it under dust. There we go. So we're making this here. So we'll go ahead and go do do, and then take the nether version and a piece of iron. Cool. I think this is a tool, so it may have more than one use, but we'll find out. Um, so we're going to need some redstone and gold. Oh, good. We have some of both. And I think this is the correct one. I don't think we're making the diamond one today. Oh, and we need silicone. Silicone was made in the furnace uh, with the nether quartz, I think you could do. We could probably make some more of the nether quartz in here. We'll put six in here. Let's right click this and see what we can get. Do 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 do. I love this high hand grinder. I mean, I would have doubled all my ores that I smelted before if I used it. Let's make sure it's actually doing you something. Yep, there you go. Um, good, silicone. Okay, so uh, let's go ahead and uh, make this puppy here. So we got the silicone. The redstone, and this, and then use the tool, which I think is a, yeah, multiple use. There you go. 50 uses, 51. Um, okay, so the ME chest had another part to it, and then I kind of forgot how to make that. So, um, oh crap, um, where's the chest now? There it is. So, uh, oh crap. Basic process, you need to smelt it, I think. Oh crap, am I smelting it right? I think so. Oh, there we go. Haha. <laughs> kind of weird, but yeah, that's what we're doing. And uh, here we go. So now we need some of this flux dust, which is both of them. We only need two right now, so can we remember? It's a nether. Let's do two of each anyways, because we'll probably need it. A nether and two of these, and... Ooh, what was the last component, guys? Oh, redstone. Yes, it was redstone. Okay, so we got that. We got the quartz. We got the iron. And then we got the nether quartz. And then the circuit. Aha! A conversion matrix has been born. Now we need a chest. Chest. Wood. <laughs> there we go. We got a chest going here, and uh, oops, I made a mistake. Sometimes I forget to uh, time my recording, so it's 1:51. Okay, so about eight minutes in there or whatever. Um, okay, so we're doing the chest thing now. Here we go. So ooh, we need some glass, some glass, old-fashioned glass, and uh, here we go. Me chest. So we go ahead and we put the iron there, and we put you there, and. You there in the glass here, and ta-da! The ME chest has been born. We need some kind of luck. Da, 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 da. Some kind of powerful, crazy, badass music, and I'm gonna put it right here. So it's dark right now for a couple of reasons, I guess. One, we don't have a uh, a storage unit, and two, we don't have power to it. Uh, it's probably mainly because of the power than anything. Um, but we'll look into the storage unit next. So. I want to do, I w would like to do the 64 storage, but you need a storage cluster. And each, this one is an advanced circuit, which is a diamond, which isn't too bad. But then you need this, which is made out of more diamonds, and more diamonds, and more diamonds, and then all the rest. Yeah, it gets too confusing. So we're going to do the 16 uh, one here, uh, which is one of these, and then one of these, and then yeah. Again, it's going to get a little confusing. Actually, that's pretty freaking confusing. I don't know if we can even do that one yet. Oh my. Uh, I'm already lost and confused. So, to make... That's a storage cell. So, storage cell... Wow. I'm already confused, guys. <laughs> Holy crap, that is uh, pretty complex, to be honest. Uh... We need to put nether quartz in here, make some more silicone here, and uh, let's go ahead and put some of you guys in here. <laughs> I like the spinning thing. Whee! 
you can right click it, I guess. There you go. And uh, we're going to put you in here as well. I just think I, I may need more silicone in the future. Okay. Wee wee wee. Okay, that should be enough for now. Um, okay, so uh, we need to make some of those. <sighs> okay, so to make one of these, it requires one of those. So one. Uh, to make one of these, it requires three of those. This is diamond version. And this one requires that. Oh wow. Yeah, so it's a lot of steps. His recipes are kind of complex for somebody who's stupid like me, but we'll figure it out. Um, okay, so I need two of those. Oh crap, this, this is this one? Oh wow. So I need three, nine, nine of these. I need nine of these. <laughs> and they're, they're just normal quartz. They're not, oh man, nine, uh, 18, 27. 36. Jesus Christ. <laughs> yeah, I cannot make that one. So we're going for the basic one. I cannot afford anything else but the basic one here. Okay, so we're doing the basic one. It's not a lot of storage, but we definitely have to earn our way up there. What the frig, dude? You have to be an asshole back there? Um. And of course it wants that cooked version here, doesn't it? Um, oh. So yeah, this is a little more complex than I expected, but that's cool. I like it. Um, which is good. I actually didn't think it was that complex. The more complex, the better, I say. The tighter she feels. What? What? What they say? There we go. I got one component of it, and uh, then you put that, glass, redstone, iron, and there you go. And then you put this here. I wonder if you can uh, melt it down. No, so apparently that's it. It stores. Oh, actually, what is this? Oh, storage housing. This seems like a different method. Oh. I don't know how you get the storage housing. Interesting. Oh, I wanted to see what else I could do with this. Uh, let's say, what can we do with this? Or I don't know. Anyways, um, let's go ahead. and uh, So we have it in there. So the next thing is just to power it simply. And we can easily power it just like this, but we're going to have to change that up. We need to change that up, but there you go. It's powering up, and it uses power over time. Um, we don't have any power reader, but it uses a slight amount of power over time. So now we can actually fill this up, and you can see the amount of uh, storage data that's being taken. And, of course, this is a lot nicer when you have 16... Thousand or the 64,000, quite nicer. Um, you can start adding a lot more to this. But now we can go and do things like this, basically. Um, there you go. And you can see they stack, so you don't have to worry about numbers. Everything stacks in there nicely. And it's a nice uh, amount of numbers, too. And basically, you just go like this, and we start stacking our rare, precious materials in here. And that's it. And this just sucks energy in. And, like, this is 20,000 energy, so, I mean, for, well, not using 20,000. I think it's, like, using one or two years of tech when it's running. And you can, I think, even stop it from running. Just like that. Um, and when you log off, apparently it doesn't use energy as well. That's what I'm being told, so that's kind of cool. Uh, inventory tweaks does not work, unfortunately, with this mod, but that's, like, almost all mods. Um, which is perfectly fine to me. There you go. And they're alphabetical order, and I think... Oh, look at that. You can sort them. For some reason, I thought you could search, but I think that's a different machine that you can later on create, where you can actually search the names and stuff, which is kind of handy. Uh, oh, that's awesome. 
So there you go. So there you go. You can see that. And you can take this with you. All my items are literally in this single item here. So I could go to Electro's house and be like, oh, here, let me pop out my, you know, my items for you. And I have them all stored in this one single item now. I think that's pretty cool myself. Um, so, uh, yeah, I'm pretty happy with that. Now, can I fill this more? Yeah, I can. But uh, we're, we're getting full, but it'll work. But look at how much space it's actually taking. Really nice, huh? So look at all the items we have. Basically, as far as I know, you have about 640 items in there. Um, and that means I have a lot of, uh, you know, space, basically. And it, if you think about it, this is only the 1K. The other one is 16K, and the one after that is 64. The only downside is you can only hold 63 types of items. Uh, but that's fine. We don't need to worry about that. And it says 46, so this is 45? No, 47. Huh. I guess I have a lot of items. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 18, 27, 36, 45, 45, 46. Yeah, yeah, I guess that makes sense, yeah. So, we're almost at the limit, unfortunately, here, as you can see with that. But you would split maybe your ores into one, whatever. Um... But yeah, that hopefully gives you a nice idea how that system works. And look at it, it pulses so little that you could leave it on all the time. Or you could be like me, and I'm going to try something I haven't used ever. I don't think I've ever used it in IC, and it's been here from day one. Um, which is this wire that I don't think anyone in IC really uses, which is weird as hell. Uh, here you go, EU Splitter. Ooh, I didn't think it was so expensive, though. Hmm, it's not too, too bad. It is kind of expensive, but I want to give it a try. For science. I don't know which one I need, though. Um, yeah, I don't think that's the kind there. I think it's this kind, like this. Yeah, okay. So this makes you HV, and we need two HV and a bunch of rubber, right? So if we go, uh, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four... I don't know how much we need. There you go. One, two, three, four. Oh, I'm doing something wrong. Was it like this? No, I'm really doing something wrong. Oh, here we go. Oh, I see. There you go. And uh, what else did we need? Uh, splitter. Um, a lever, a lever, and some redstone. So, uh... Let's go and get that redstone. We can put these back in here. And, uh, where's the wood? I guess I got all the wood. I need cobblestone. Cobble dick requested. So, unfortunately, as much as this was really, really cool and it works really well, it kind of does suck in a way, as in. It will, I mean, it's only got 64 types of slots. So, yeah, where it will replace a lot of stuff here, unfortunately, I have a lot of different items, so I would not be able to fill this entire system. But we will come to a better method to handle that down the road. So, we'll show you that, definitely. Um, I wonder if you can label them. Probably an anvil, maybe? I'm not sure. Or it'll blow them up, who knows. Uh, okay, so what were we making here? Uh, a lever, we need to make a couple of them. And, uh, here we go. And a piece of redstone. And this puppy. And there you go. And I don't think... Does this go on the ground, or does this clamp over a wire? I've never... Whoa! This is so badass. Oh, here it is. So watch this. So it is still pulsing. You can see from the machine. And this should stop all pulses forever now. So now this machine will eventually run out of energy. It doesn't tell you how much energy it holds, but uh, the machine will slowly run out of energy. But it's as simple as me coming over here and, you know, dealing with it. I don't know if I can try to wear out the energy. It probably has a nice buffer. I mean, who knows how much it holds. But anyways, over time, it'll definitely run out of energy. And it sounds like a war going out there. I guess it's daytime now? I'm not sure. Let's check here. Um, yep, sun. 6 a.m. 6 Basically, the second it's like 6 a.m., 
pretty much every single mob should have been dead by then. Like, it seems like a perfect time. Unless if, you know, something else is happening. So, um, yeah, this was awesome. I like that. I'm really excited that I finally built that. Uh, so the next machine, I think, is time for uh, a furnace and uh, move on. I love that. I've never made that before. A little embarrassing, to be honest, never making that. I'm going to break this, so it's going to charge up, unfortunately. But you can see it holding a nice charge in there. And boom. Uh, I wonder... Ambis, I talk to, and he says, your mod has no icon. Anyways, um, okay, so, um, yeah, I'm trying to fix an issue with another mod. So I wanted to ch check this chest. Does it say how much you stored in it? No. Let me just ask here. <laughs> I love the internet. Uh, just doing my LP and w wanted to know what the EU buffer is on the ME chest. Anyways. Um, so yeah, we want to make, what, a furnace next? An electric furnace? So we've done a furnace, of course. See, the next one would be an electric furnace, which is honestly just adding a circuit. And the circuit is made out of the copper, a refined iron, etc. So let's get this out. Let's get the refined iron. Oh, I wonder if you go like this. Oh, good. It only gives you one stack at a time. Because I'm a, I'm a habit of shift-clicking. I wouldn't want to learn a new way of, you know, dragging items out of there. Um, but, uh... Okay, so we got redstone, copper, um, I forget what we're even doing now. <laughs> uh, oh yeah, wire. Uh, do do do, boom 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 boom, boom 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 boom. And, uh, I don't know what we're missing. Oh, we'll probably need a furnace, so let's grab this. Now, don't do that with every machine in the game. Uh, some machines, I know for sure that works, but some things can't be just broken. Some of them will eat the items. Uh, most of them have been fixed over the years and stuff like that, but uh, you got to be careful. There's some derpy things out there. You'll get owned if you don't. So the EU, AE chest, basically, the ME chest, I mean, holds 15... Uh, 100 EUs, just to give you an idea. And I didn't get redstone. Or, whatever. Um, oh, that's another thing I'm going to have to build soon. What am I doing anymore? I've built like 100 of these, and here... Oh, wait. Actually, let's go back. Is there a new chip that I can build? No, there isn't, is there? It's a, it's a special one, I think. A basic circuit board. Hmm. What happened to doubling this? Maybe you can't anymore? I'm not sure. Actually, that other one looked doubled, but... Whatever. Anyways, uh, do-do, 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 and then do-do, do-do, and then, uh... Where the hell did all the iron go? Oh, there you go. Ran out of power to give you an idea. <laughs> did it like run out of power when I was dragging out the iron? <laughs> so we used to use silver, um, and I think that doesn't work. And actually, are we supposed to use refined iron for this? I think so. Um, so for example, this is used to be the recipe here. And uh, this would double your chips, which was amazing. And then your two refined iron, and then your to do, to do, to do, to do, to do, to do. And of course, that doesn't work anymore. Unfortunately, we're back to the, just the redstone. I think he nerfed that, because it was a pretty overpowered recipe. Um, I was starting to like do anything to use that myself, and I assume that's one of the reasons why he ended up nerfing it down the road. Um, which makes sense, because it was pretty powerful, like I said. So here you go. So we can just open this up. If you're smart, you'll use something rather than 
You'd use an axe, but I'm not smart. There we go. And we just go like this. We'll extend this here, because future, right? I hate putting this right beside there, but I guess I do it all the time anyways. Um, so I'll just do it anyways. <laughs> so there you go. You got the electric furnace. And uh, this is definitely a little faster now, which is nice. Um, so we're just at uh, grinded down uh, iron here. Oh, that's the quartz. There you go. Nope, there you go. The power ran out. That gives you an idea. So you take this, and there you go. We, we cook it up. Oh, and it died when I took the one piece. So, yeah, so you gotta turn it on again like this and then grab that iron. <laughs> it's kind of funny. There we go. And there you go, now it's just draining there and you can see the pulse, it drains off of there. Quite, quite a heavy pulse compared to, you know, that ch chest draining uh, over time. And, uh, yeah, there's the electric furnace. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, my next uh, thing I would like to make down the road would be some kind of macerator. Macerator is a little expensive, though. Uh, the macerator comes in this nice shape and form. And uh, we're going to do it. <laughs> so let's just do it. There we go. Ah! Wait, I decided I don't want it now. It's like, yes, guys, look at our doopy diamonds. I got six in there and one in there. Hi, dupe diamonds. I've duped diamonds! Oh, oh, oh. God, that, that was frightening. That was frightening. That was overly frightening. Maybe I should just keep this on when I'm working. Um, okay, so, industrial grinder. I don't know if I should be having, uh, whatever. I don't think Greg would approve. Um, anyways, macerator here. So, we're gonna take... Oh, yeah, we need more than just that, don't we? So, first of all, uh, we're gonna go here, and you can see all the different blocks here. We're just gonna go with the normal machine block, perfect. And then we need an advanced circuit. There's an elite circuit as well you can build. Uh, requires a diamond. What the frack? Yeah, I won't be elite circuiting this today. Um, oh, wait. Oh, diamond... Grinder. Oh yeah, we can't do that yet. Okay, that's down the road. Okay, so we need an advanced circuit, so that's fine. Uh, redstone, lapis. So you need redstone. We have redstone. Yeah, we need some lapis and uh, glowstone. And uh, so it's been a while since I did this, but it's something like this, I think. Oh crap! And the circuit, but then there was something on the corners. Is the glowstone, and then the redstone. Oh, it's been so long. Or maybe the redstone like this. I think it was like this actually. There we go. Vant circuit and uh, macerator. Oh god. Let's try not to. Oh crap. We need to. Crap. I need flint and steel. Let's see how cool this hand is. This hand grinder. Can uh, do this. Oh crap. Oh well. So we'll just go ahead and grind this puppy up. I'm hoping it'll actually grind the f uh, stuff up, but I don't know if it can. Yes, it does. Nice. Whee! Actually, I don't know. I seem a little more efficient there. There's seven there, so. We'll either get seven or more. I almost thought it was doubling it, but I, I'm probably wrong. But the macerator, does it double it? Maybe. I don't know. No, it was seven. Okay, so, um, make the macerator, pop up. And so we got this, we got the three diamonds. Mommy, mommy. We got the flint and steel, and... We take that all out, and we make the machine block, refined iron in a square, and then we do the flint and steel again. We do the diamonds. What the heck was that? Oh, you could do this apparently now.
Oh, you hold it like that? Is that how you do it, Electro? Hmm, he told me about this. Let's do this again. So you put this here. So, for example, oh, what the hell is this? You go like this, and you can go like this. I'm holding it down. I'm not actually dropping it. Oh, look at this. It does it in your inventory, too. What the frig? Anyways, um, and then this here, and the diamond here, and the machine block. And here we go. We got our first macerator. And this baby will be awesome. So what does the macerator do? It does basically what this does, um, and it just grinds down your ore. So for example, I have 63 uh, iron here, and I put it in the macerator, and she will slowly take, of course. But uh, she will produce uh, double the iron and dust, and that's kind of the whole point of it. While we're at it, we should do one more here, and I think we, we will. There you go. Double the iron. That's all. Oh, excuse me. Um, one more thing I want to do before we go, and uh, I think it's kind of important here. Um... What was I doing again? I want to make the extractor, but I can't even think for my own ass here. Here we go. So we're going to have to... Let's try this. Let's try this. Uh... Oh, there you go. So right click does one layer. Left click does two layers. Or, I mean, uh, like everything you have. Well, that is cool. Um, okay, so this is like shift clicking, right? I don't know. Well, I don't even know what I'm doing. It's 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 crack, guys. Don't do drugs. Um, did I not make two of these? Whatever. And uh, you there, and you there, and ta-da! And then we need the machine block here, so we go ahead and. You just go like that and hold it. So I just did the hold. Like, I didn't do anything special. And, uh... Put you up here. And then you there. And there you go. Extractor. So the extractor is probably my favorite thing in the world. And I'll show you why. Oh. So you gotta let go. You gotta remember to let go. I have a feeling that... See, I have uh, this... I gotta get used to this. So it's like this, right? And that's all. Let go there. But I have a tendency to keep dragging it, and that's my issue. Um, okay, so let's show you how this puppy works here quickly. Let's take out this damn annoying spider. And we're going to do something about that soon. I'm definitely going to do something soon. Probably not next episode. I think the next episode we're going to go mining. I think I said that's what we are going to do before. Um, but we're going to definitely do something. A little surprise for mobs in the near future here. Oh, got to be careful. Let's see here. There we go. Oh, some more over here. Where did we go? Perfect. Do do do. Hey! Oh, that tool thing is annoying. I wonder, I'll get Electro, I'll see if he'll, he can do it or something, but I think there's a way we can add this to an ignore list. Certain items to the ignore list that, you know, will retract it automatically for you. Okay, there we go. So we'll just throw that away. <laughs> we should grab something to eat here. I wonder if Imbus said anything. No, he didn't. I hope he got what I meant. Imbus is an awesome guy. Um, I guess he was missing an icon or something it's called. So we put this puppy down. And we put this in here to get extract the sticky resin. And this is enough uh, size. Four. So I think the fifth one you start losing one EU a tick on the uh, cable. And you can have some little issues there. But uh, if we go ahead now and throw this here for example. Um, there we go. So everything can run and should run with enough power. So there you go. One resin extracted, and I got three rubber. Yeah, you get three rubber using this, which is really lovely. Wait for it to do it. Got to do it live. 
and 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 yeah! okay and if you click this it shows you all the recipes you can get so slime balls will give you two rubber nice uh, empty cells etc shows you wool you can get rid of the default wool color that's actually really cool uh, you can do all the great tech cells basically too uh, looks like you could actually get more too um, from dyes and stuff like that a rubber tree can give you one rubber <laughs> a sapling anyways Overall, it's mostly derpy stuff, but uh, that's, that's cool. Just make sure there's not something I've missed that, that's amazing, that, you know, reason to do it. Nope, that's it. Indiglo, die, interesting. Indiglo, blossom. Huh. Compressor. Oh, it's just uh, it register as a plant, I guess. There you go. So that's pretty awesome. So, uh, yeah, I think that takes care of this episode. I think the next episode, maybe we'll go to that ravine and do some mining. Because I think, yeah, I'm pretty sure, uh, excuse me, uh, we're, we're good time to go mining. And I would really love to do some mining. So uh, I'll see you guys on the next episode for the mining episode. So thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed the episode. And uh, I'll see you next time.